Hey guys, welcome back to an episode of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Last episode we started actually getting Ginny's things back. As you can see, we currently have... Let's have a quick look here. What, what are we missing? We're missing the spell or tape. We've got the quill and the scales last time, so we need to go to the Leaky Cauldron here, which we haven't actually been to yet. If I'm correct, that is where Hagrid normally chills, I think. Okay, I actually want to check out and see if there's anything cool here with our Lumos, because it feels like there will be. I guess not. Okay, is this the Leaky Cauldron then? It looks it. Let's go and pop in. So I'm wondering, if, is Hagrid going to actually be in here? Because that would be awesome if he is. So I've got no idea what spell... Oh my god, Hagrid is actually here. I've got no idea what spell -o tape looks like, and I'm guessing it looks like that. It looks like cello tape, but... With spells, I guess. Oh, wow. Okay, um... Interesting. Oh, we've got a birdie box and every bit of Every safe player been there. Oh, come on, just keep giving me those beans, come on. Boom, there we go, a stick. Oh, no, sick, even. Boom, yuck, on underpants. We're up to 12 out of 50. I'm really wondering what do we get if we actually get a full set. That would be so cool if we do like... Ugh, okay, okay, let's just uh, keep going, just keep going. Ooh, there's a button here. Let's push it. Boom. Okay, okay. Oh, so we're going to have to go back through. Okay, okay, easy enough. Let's open the door and go through. Oh, there's some turtles. I'm pretty sure those turtles were actually in the last game as well. I think at least. Let's get some more... Oh, beans are everywhere here, like... I'm not going to lie about that, like, I'm happy with this. Also, Harry's going to get really overweight with all these beans, like, he's literally eating so many beans. Good on him, though, like, you know, do it while you're young, you know, eat as much crap as you want, because that's, that's what I do. Okay, how do you kill these? Do we have to, like, how do you kill them? Okay, it looks like we can't kill them, it's just to stun them. Okay, that's fine, you know, if, if it allows us to get some more cool stuff, come on, I want to hit this thing, just get some more beans. Okay, we, we, we don't want to get killed by the turtle, because I've got a feeling this turtle will do contact damage to us. Okay, there we go. Okay, what was the 22? Okay, I'm guessing this is a, this class is the first dungeon in the game then. Okay, anything over here? Uh, anything to destroy? Anything to destroy? Maybe some kind of Lumos stuff? Okay, I, I don't know why I'm going to try to use Lumos a lot more, because I've got a feeling that there's going to be something hidden away here. And if we miss it, I'm going to be annoyed, so, okay. So, I'll do some platforming, come on. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, the plays, the plays! Okay, is anything over here? Okay. Oh, there is some stuff here. Okay, beans. I'm loving all these beans the game's giving me, like, I'm not going to deny them. Also, I feel like the placement of beans, by the way, is very inconsistent. Like, how are we meant... To, we can't get those beans. Like, we literally can't get them. Like, ugh, it's annoying that. It's glitchy as hell. Like, some of these beans just do, go, get placed in stupid places. Also, can we get that one there? No. Okay, let's just go through here, then. I just wish that beans didn't spawn in really annoying places where you can't get. Oh. Oh, wow. Um, that's not ideal. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, okay. We'll, we'll have to do the sneak, we will, okay. We learned it in the last episode. Oh, wow, I'm loving the Leaky Cauldron, you know. I, I don't think I've actually ever been in the Leaky Cauldron in the game, so this is like a whole new experience to me. Wow, it's pretty It's pretty epic, you know. It's like a follow -up. Ah, I don't think I meant to do that. Nope, I didn't. God damn it. One thing I really love about this game is that we, get, we actually get to explore the Harry Potter world. So one thing I love about this game is the fact that you can actually explore like the whole Harry Potter world, you know, just from... Okay, let's push this. Let's not fall down now. There we go. You actually, actually explore the whole Harry Potter world in a whole new way. I know, like, with the books, you can get, like, a whole new sense of adventure, but you're not actually playing the story. Like, I know how this game is going to end, because I, I know I've seen the film. But it's kind of cool that we're, like, looking at it from a whole new perspective. You know, we're not just playing Harry Potter. You know, we're, we're actually our Harry Potter, if that makes sense. I know it sounds a bit weird, but, like... In this game, we're actually Harry Potter. We are the boy who lived. Okay, balls. That's not good. Okay, let me get the bean. Let me get the bean. What? What? Okay, these beans are glitchy as hell. Like, okay, I can see why no one ever goes 100% in this game. Because, like, it's impossible. Because it just is. Like, it, the beans just go into stupid places all the time. And <laughs> you can't pick them up. Okay, it's fine. Let's leave a leaky, leaky cauldron. I wonder if Hagrid's going to be here. Is there a door, maybe? Is there a door? Am I missing something? Door? Um... Is that a door? Um, oh, Lumos. Numpty. Christ. I should have known that. You know, I, I, I said I was going to use Lumos more. There we go. We're back through the leaky cauldron. Ooh. Okay. Let's let's talk to, let's talk to Hagrid before we complete this. What up, Hagrid? How you doing? How you doing, bro? Can we talk? Hey. Hey, can we talk? Can we talk, please? Did I tell you? I've been having a bit of trouble lately with flesh-eating slugs. Oh, yeah. If you don't know, he's obsessed with flesh-eating slug repellent. Also... G give me what's in the house. There's more than butterbeer down in the cellar, you know, Mr. Potter. Ooh, is that a, a hint? Also, the coins haven't despawned, which is great. Okay, let's have a quick look, see if there's anything else to find in here. 
I'm, sp I'm sure there isn't actually like a chest, but you know, boom, there we go. We've got the Spello Tape. Now, I'm not to be confused with Cello Tape because they're both the same name. Okay, is there any chest in here? I don't know why I've got a feeling there's got to be a chest in here. There has to be somewhere. Okay, there's actually a door over here. Can we go through here? No. I'm wondering, are we going to get like Alohomora in this game so we can just open any door? I know we've got like, what's it called? Um, what's that? What's that move called? You know, the the one where it pushes people back. The hand one. I can't remember what it's called. But Alohomora allows you to open any door. It's pretty well known in the Harry Potter universe. I'm hoping we're to get that in, the, in this game because that would be epic. You know, running around opening any door we want. We could become international bank thieves. How awesome would that be? Also, it's kind of lucky that all wizards except Voldemort have got, like, moral. Hello there, Harry. I found all your things, Ginny. Oh, Harry, you're so wonderful. No, really. It was nothing. You're such a kind boy, Harry. Here, have a chocolate frog for your efforts. Thanks, Mrs. Weasley. Gilderoy Lockhart signing copies of his latest book in Flourish and Blots. We were thinking of going in to see him. Would you like to come with us, Harry? No. Uh, well... Okay, then. Thanks. Let's go inside. I really feel like Mrs. Weasley is really fattening me up. Like, she keeps giving me chocolate frogs at every possible chance she gets. God damn it, man. Let's go and see Gilderoy Lockhart anyway. I really don't like Gilderoy Lockhart. You, you guys will probably get to see in this Let's Play why I don't like him. Oh, that's not the right place either. Um, he's kind of a bit of an, an idiot. That's all I'm going to say. He's a bit of an idiot. And we're going to walk in and visit Gilderoy Lockhart, which, like I said, massive idiot. Massive. Great Scott! Is that... No, surely not. It is. It's Harry Potter! <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the perfect moment for me to make an important announcement. I have great pleasure in announcing that this term, I will be taking up the post of Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Bet you loved that, didn't you, Potter? Famous Harry Potter. Can't even go into a bookshop without making the front page. Leave him alone. He didn't want all that. Potter's got a girlfriend. I suppose your parents will go hungry for a month to pay for all the books you're going to need at Hogwarts. Here, girl, take this one. It's the least I can do to help out the poor and needy. <coughs> Let me give you some coaching, Harry. Fame is a fickle friend, and I would encourage you to be careful how you play the fame game, so to speak. Be sparing with your public appearances at first, and watch the company you keep. Harry! Why, I remember the time when I was writing my second bestseller, Gadding with Cools. Harry, we missed the train! I believe the more exposure I got in the press, the better my career would progress. <laughs> Miss the train? Trouble was, I became overexposed. Yes! The Hogwarts Express left five minutes ago. And it wasn't until I went mysteriously missing for three weeks. Oh no! What are we going to do? Subsequently leaking the story to the Prophet. Well, I know that Dad took the flying car to work this morning. It's parked in Charing Cross Road. That I'd been captured by trolls in the wilds of Stockton on Tees. OK, it's our only chance of getting to school on time. That I managed to regain my former prominent position as the world's most popular wizard. Harry? Oh. Random fact, I actually live right near Stockton on Tees. Right now when I'm recording this, so that's pretty epic. And, uh, yeah, we're going to be flying the car. Also, I love how the train left whilst we were shopping. There was, like, no explanation. Just like, oh, no, we missed the train. Like, how? It makes no sense. I'll meet you in the courtyard outside the leaky cauldron. I just find that so, so surreal that literally we missed the train by going to pick up a book. Even though Ginny was there with us and so was Ron's mother. But they didn't miss the train. We did. Makes no sense. I know we're trying to go with, like the plot of the movie, but wow. Ready to go to Hogwarts, Harry? You know, Ron, I'm really not sure about this. We've got to get to school, haven't we? And even underage wizards are allowed to use magic if it's a real emergency. Section 19 or something of the uh, re restriction thingy. You're sure you can fly it, okay? What's it look like? 
I'm doing all right, aren't I? Yeah, I suppose. So far. So it does look like the actual original voice actors from the first game has actually reprised their role, I can tell with Ron, I can tell with Harry, they are the same voice actors as previously. But yeah, let's continue on with the cutscenes. Harry! There's Hogwarts! Straight ahead! Uh-oh! So it does look like, oh my god, this is actually a stage though. The Whomping Willow, oh my god, this is cool. This is epic. So we're actually on the tree. <laughs> the... Ah, seriously? Seriously? Okay, let's take this a lot more slower, come on. Okay, it's worth it to go down, worth it to go down, come on. Yeah, jump. Okay, okay. I do feel like a lot, a lot of the points when you lose, like, actual, like, things. Also, oh cool, these guys give stuff, okay. I feel like a lot of the time when you, when you actually, ooh, okay. When you get hit in this game, it's a lot of BS, if you ask me. It is a lot of BS. Like, some of the stuff I should not get hit by. But I do, and it's really annoying. If I'm honest, it really is. Oh, God. Like, a lot of the things you, you notice in this game, like, you don't really think it's going to actually affect the game, and it does. Like, like for example, uh, I'm picking up beans right now. A random sprout could just come straight out from the Whomping Willow and just attack me. That's annoying, you know? And it's one of the main things I, I'm not liking about this game. Like, the amount of RNG in... And stuff in this game is ridiculous. Okay, there's something down there, isn't there? Oh, did you guys see that reach? That reach right then was ridiculous. Also, of course, one of our beans. Oh, but oh, for, no, 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 no. Okay, I feel like we have to. We have to go that. Ooh. Okay. Uh, oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Ah, yes. Okay, boom. There we go. Okay, we can hit him. So let's go back and see hit this guy. Also, Ro um, Harry doing parkour. He like parkour master Harry. Okay, come on. Oh, balls. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Oh, oh, you just missed me, bruh. You missed me. Okay, come on. Come on. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. Okay, what's actually up here? Okay, oh. Oh, my God. What's it, what's it doing? What's it doing? Can we actually attack that? Okay, we can dodge roll. Okay, it's fine. Let's just leave this area. Don't attack me. Don't attack me. Okay, okay. I, I'm trying to get the hang of that to this area because it seems pretty cool. I know we've got a map, but I'm going to try to use the map as little as possible. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh my god, like, these guys seriously do some serious damage to you. Like, everything in this game is out to get you, isn't it? Like, if you think about it. Okay, can I get this? Nope, nope. Okay, I'm trying to get some bit of silver fire beans as well, so, as well, whilst we're going along here. I've got a feeling that's going to be a whomping willow arm. Oh, no, oh, not okay, fine by me. We'll get some more beans. Boom, there we go. We actually get some more HP back. I feel like they're going to be pretty pretty good with HP in this area, because I feel like you're going to take a lot of hits. I really do feel like that way. Um, here we go. Urk, plemp, or whatever it was. Okay, okay. I don't know how we're going to save Harry, by, uh, not Harry, Ron, even, because, like, he's somewhere on the... Well, we could just leave... Really? Re oh, for God's sake, now, come on. Like, it's not even letting me go down there, and, like, it just threw it off the edge. And again, like, you really expect me to go all the way around for that? Because well, I am going to go all the way around for it, but, you know, is it going to despawn? Let's see. It's despawned in the time it took me to get... Like, that is really bad placement of Bird Bot Silver Flayer Beans. It really is, like, anyone... And it let me fall down, it let me fall down there. Um, I feel like a lot of the placement of these beans are just really stupidly placed, and I'm not going to deny that. Like, I feel like they are, and they get stuck in walls and stuff. And I know that's by the by the limitations of the PlayStation 2 and stuff. Oh god. Okay, okay, it's fine, it's fine. Really, really. Okay, puffer pods can hit, be hit by Flipendo, which is the, the attack I'm doing. I'm not going to lie. A lot of this crap in this game is so stupid. Okay. Okay, fine. Is there any more beans? Yes. Okay. Oh wow, they do have three beans in. Any more? Okay. Okay, also, they, they can hold HP as well. Okay, let's wait for this guy to attack. Okay, wait, wait, where's this guy attack? Okay, there, come on. Are you going to attack? Are you going to attack? Come on. Okay, fine, I'll go for a run. How much bane is going to hit straight now, isn't he? Oh my god, that was so close. That was ridiculously close. Okay, okay, we, we made it through, we made it through, which is good. Okay, let go, Harry. So we're going to hit this, this thing. How much bane is going to fall straight off the edge? Oh, it's not. So I'm wondering, with, with these beans, do you think... It depends on where you're facing them. If you're facing them at a certain angle... Oh, God. All right. I actually didn't see him there. He could have easily hit us there. Um, I feel like it depends on your angle and where you're actually stood. Because if you're stood, like, a, on a certain angle, 
it's probably going to fly out at a certain angle, and that's probably what is happening. It's probably not me. I'm trying to actually go for the game now because I really want to love this game. Oh god, oh god, okay, okay. Okay, he's, he's got no. I would say he's got no beans then. It's spawn one, okay. Can we get this guy? Okay. I did not want to fall down there then. Okay. Let, let's get another bit of boss beans. Ooh, popcorn, okay. Okay, that's all of them. Okay, I feel like those are actually designed there to actually do that. A hit like that. For God's sake, man. Uh, I'm saying everything's out to get you in this game. Everything is out to get you. Okay. Anything? Bean. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay. I wonder if these beans respawn. Do you think? They might do anymore. Yes. Yes, boys. Yes. Okay, what we got down here? Okay, okay. Um, Was there any reason actually coming up here? There has to be a reason. Maybe we can actually get on top over here. Can we actually climb on the whipping willow here? No. Do we just go down here then? Maybe? Maybe? Do, do we just jump down? Okay, we'll have a look around. We'll have a look around. Okay, this is where we start off, which could be the... It's not where we start off. This looks new. It looks very new. Okay, wow. Uh, uh, pumpkin pie there, which we'll just get. I, I know it's not a pumpkin pie, but you know, I forget the names. Okay, have we got any more stuff? No. Okay, okay. I feel like we should run past this guy over here. Okay, okay. Oh, good, oh, good. Run away, run away. Okay. Can we actually jump this? No. Okay, that's fine. Okay, let's bust this open. Okay, let's get away from that guy as well. Like, what is that, man? Jesus Christ. Like, I know I got awfully close there, but... Like, that was total BS. you got to admit, that was a load of BS. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I'll, 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 I'll let the game off, you know. I feel like the radius on those mushrooms... Pretty ridiculous. If you ask me. Really, really ridiculous. So it's like we can't go back that way anyway. Okay, you can use Splendor to attack a lot. Wait, what? It's a boss. It looks a bit like a dragon, don't you think? Okay, fine, let me run a boss fight here. Oh my god, there's... Oh my god, there's so many gnomes! God damn it, gnomes! Okay, okay, this is a little mini boss. Okay, let, let's just keep spamming it up and down. and getting their spawn points. That'll teach them. Okay, they can't get me if I, if I can keep moving. That's my strategy right here. If you just keep moving, we know their weakness, okay? What even are these? Are they some kind of gremlins or something? Whatever they are, look very menacing. There we go, we've killed them all, though. Get, get, get our beans. A plum berry. Oh, wow. And there's actually a lot of berries here. So I'm wondering, we are close to 50 now. Can we actually get to 50? I'm hoping we can. I, I, be I believe we can. Okay, just keep giving me them. Come on, you got to have another one. you got to have another one. No, okay. We're missing four. Okay, let's, let's have a look here. Can we destroy these? Yes, we can. Get some more beans over here. Come on. Okay, some more beans. Boom. We're on 49. How much beans are we going to lose one now, aren't we? Okay, come on. Oh, wait, wait. What's going to happen? Uh, oh, we're just at 50. Is, like, I'm guessing that's the max we can hold until we actually get to like a certain purchase point. Let's have a look. Okay, are you going to spawn any more beans? N oh, yeah. Okay, so what, what happens now? Okay, looks like we can't carry more beans. But, of course, it was a trap with the chest, wasn't it? God damn it, Weeping Willow. Okay, at least we get a cool chest. What are going to get here? Is it going to be a card or is it going to be... Ooh, what the hell is that? A, co uh, a piece of cauldron cake. It's probably just going to give us some HP back. Okay, can we jump this? Oh, we can. Oh, it's going to allow us to actually get up here now, isn't it? Boom, parkour. Okay, we need some kind of treat. For head, we're going to It's going to be on the other side of here, so we're going to jump back down. Okay, it's, it's kind of lucky that this actually did fall here. If you think about it, like, what was the chance in that? Like, going for the chest actually solved something for us. I thought it was actually going to, like, screw us over. So we need some kind of head to, to, uh, treat to actually progress. And I just jumped off the edge again. Another negative with this game, uh, other than the placement of beans, is the fact that the control system is very, very precise. I know it's the early age of the analog stick, and the analog stick is still... I didn't even jump there, for God's sake. I know the analog stick is still new, but it just doesn't control right. It really just... Like, you jump off every single cliff even though you don't want to, if that makes sense. Like, there should be a button what says jump. Like, I know it sounds a bit stupid, but it would make this a lot easier than having to keep going round and round in circles. Like that. Okay, let's not fall. Ooh, there's a chest up here. I, mean, I totally missed this chest, so I'm kind of glad I did fall down. We're going to give me... Ooh, it's a, it's a bloody uh, wizard card. This is our first wizard card of the episode, actually. What we got? Number four. Grogan Stump. So I wonder what happens if we get, like, a full set of these 12. It might, it might Something cool might happen. Like I said, I'm not going to go for 100% in this game, but if I do get a few cards here and there, there you go. Enjoy them as you will. Okay, okay. Is there anything else over here? Or was it just for the card? Was it really just for the card? I feel like it was just for the card, wasn't it? I had a, I had a full-on run there for no reason. Also, oh my god, that was good catching, by the way. I was, I was actually going to complain again there, but the game... I'm not going to lie. That is... The whole grapple system in this game is very useful. It works very well. Very, very well. I'll, I'll, I'm happy with that, you know. I'm proud of the game for actually having a good control system like, like that, you know. It actually, has, it, I have got some great, like, upper body strength, you know. We can literally just teleport around. 
Okay, can I climb up here maybe? No. Okay, I'm not gonna mess with those plants there. Okay. Ooh, there's actually a whole area over here. Ooh, what the heck? This is like a boss fight, don't you think? Very menacing. Oh, yeah. Oh, some kind of were dog. Oh, God, oh, God. Okay, werewolves. Okay, I don't know how we're gonna kill these, by the way. Lumos, maybe. Lumos. Okay, is that right? Oh, yes, Lumos. Of course, these guys might hit me, though, but it seems like Lumos is the way to kill these guys. Oh, b balls, man. Okay, I don't know how I'm meant to do this, but is, is it gonna be, like, damage over time? Maybe just, like, hold them at it? Yep, okay. I feel like that is... that. That is. Oh, yeah, that's how you kill them. Okay. Lumos. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, I want to keep on my beans, though. That's the thing. Okay, Lumos, come on. Okay, let's kill one of them here. Ah, no! Okay, it's annoying because there's more upper ones and there's not just one werewolf. I know... Oh, for God's sake, that's not good. That's not good. Ah, he's got me. Oh, it looks a bit like a, a greyhound, do you think? Like the uh, song by um, Sweet House. Also, what the hell? It's out of bounds. Like, I, I can't... That is stupid. That is, like the AI can go out of bounds, but you can't. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty BS. There, you gotta admit. Like, and all of my, uh, I'm I'm annoyed by all of my beans actually sp spawning out of bounds as well. Like, like I, we can't go back now either, which is so much more annoying. Like, I know I can understand why. Like, it makes it so it's a lot more linear and stuff. But there's, there's a lot of things I can tell which are gonna be very annoying in this game. I'm not gonna lie, that was a cool boss fight though. We don't have to use just a normal spells. You have to use other spells, which makes it. Interesting, you know, it's, you don't have to, like, just use your normal spells. Okay, let's put it back up to 50. There we go. Okay, come climb through here. Yeah, we can. I did like the idea of that boss, but I feel like it was very poorly executed with the whole hour bouncing. It was literally in the wall at one point. God damn it, man. Okay, I can hear something. I can hear something. Ooh, it's more dragons. Okay, it's fine. What you do is you just keep mashing this button, just spamming it, you know. It seems to work pretty well, actually. Like, these guys can't hit you as long as you're running, so. Okay, boom. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, son. Get wrecked. Okay, I know I need to carry more beans, but just, yeah, I wonder if there's going to be upgrades so I actually like, be able to carry more beans. That'll be pretty cool. I like the idea of a currency system, by the way. It's very cool. It's very, very cool in this game. Okay, boom. Okay, okay. I, so far, I'm actually enjoying that. I enjoyed the first game a lot more than this. I don't, I don't know why. It just doesn't feel natural to me. And I know a lot of people probably love this game, but, like, from, from this point on, I've never played it. Like, it's totally blind to me. And right now, I feel like there's a lot of problems with it. With it. And, uh, sorry about that. I actually um, <laughs> started, uh off in there. Uh, I feel like there's a lot of problems with this game, which isn't ideal, like, with a game. Okay, where are these guys at? Um, uh, I, can, I can see what one's showing me. Um, where you at? Where, where you at, dog? Um, I can't actually see where he is. He, he was showing at us just then. Ah, it's fine. We'll just leave him. Let's, let's just leave him. Wait, we can't leave. Okay. Oh, oh, there's one. Boom, there we go. Okay, are they all... What the hell? Did he just get quick scope on me? Um, where's that guy at? Who, who just got a quickscope on me, like? So someone got a bloody good quickscope. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, and guess what? The beans fell out of bounds again. I'm not gonna lie, those guys got a massive quickscope on me then. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's go up here. Oh, oh wow, we can go up here. Oh wow, and they're just gonna keep running away, aren't they? Okay, fine, if you guys wanna, if you guys wanna play like that then. Okay, fine. We, we did actually get, oh, actually a way to actually refill our pot here. Remember we bought a pot a few episodes ago to actually use as a... HP, so we can actually get like instant HP like a fairy, like in Zelda. And uh, where's that last guy at? Okay, there he is. Boom. Come here. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. One of those got a really good shot on me, a really good quick scope. I, I'm gonna give him that. Like, that was a really good quick scope. I didn't see that coming. Okay, get some more beans. Okay, parkour. Boom. And there's actually a chest here, so it's gonna be so worth our time. Let's open it up and see what we got. Come on. Come on. Open it up. Come on. And it's another wizard card. This should actually increase our stamina if I'm correct. Oh no, one off. But who is it? Okay, there we go. That's our next wizard card. Let's just continue on. Okay, I think I think I'm gonna get to the end of this level and I'm gonna end it. To be honest, okay. Let's open this up. Come on. Let's see what we've got in here. Ooh, it's a uh, another and another box of lucky charms. You know, a, little, a bit of a uh, Irish gold, I guess. I do feel like the life system is very well done, by the way, in this game. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna slide that off. I feel like they, they give you if anything if anything way too much health. Okay. If I get hit by that, I'm gonna, I'm calling BS on that. Okay, good. Okay, let's get some more beans. Okay, so where do we go from here, then? Like, I thought we'd have to go over here. Hmm. Oh, God. Okay, I'm sitting away from these guys, because these guys are annoying. Okay, let's wait for it to defog. Okay, anything? Anything? No, no. Okay. Let's just go back down here, then. Okay, I know I'm missing something blatantly obvious. Maybe I have to go through the... Nope. Okay, what am I missing? Also, it appears there is fall damage in this game, so that's uh, something to be aware of. You can damage yourself by falling. Maybe it's over here. Is this? Oh, balls, man. Of course I got hit again. 
Maybe it's actually in here. Oh, it is. It is. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to lie. We're losing a lot of HP here, which we shouldn't be losing, but we are. <laughs> I just took this game, you know. That's one thing about playing a blind game. You don't know what to expect. What kept you, Harry? I can't hang around here all night, you know. Very funny, Ron. Now, how on earth am I going to release you? Is there some kind of weak spot on the tree you could cast a spell at? Okay, it's time for a boss fight, it looks like. Okay, let's look on. Oh my god, he's literally just punching us, isn't he? Bloody hell. Okay, I want to get all my beans back. Or at least as many as I can. Okay, can we get the other one to get back? Come on. My god, he's got some kind of shockwave ability, hasn't he? Okay, this is not good. Okay. I want to attack. I want, I want to be able to attack this guy. Oh, for god's sake. Okay. I don't know what I'm meant to be attacking here, by the way. Okay. What the F, man? What is... I'm getting absolutely destroyed. Like, I'm nearly dead. Okay, let's actually go and um, put our potion on here. Okay, I don't even know. Oh, it's actually house points in this. Okay, let's, let's, let's use our, our vial here. Why not? Uh, let's put it on um, Y. Uh, how do I use this? Yeah, it's Phil. How do I use it? Oh, so it just uses... Ah, it does it automatically. I see, I see. So I'm looking for... Oh, my god, like, literally, the shockwaves on this boss is ridiculous. Okay, let's fall back. Let's fall back. Okay, maybe something to do with the car. Oh, it's the hands. I see. I see. I get it now. Okay, let's charge up. Come on. Okay, I, I'm guessing I've got to wait for the shockwave to hit. Oh, my god. So it looks like if it's purple, it will go back. Oh. My, I'm, I'm stuck in this. I really am. Okay, let's try out this then. Luminos, come on. I don't understand what I'm meant to be doing. I don't understand. Like, I mean, I mean I'm literally so confused with this boss. Like, well, I'm nearly dead, aren't I? I, I don't know. I, I don't know what to do, that's the thing, I, I don't understand that, listen, I'm dead, I've literally just died, I have no idea what I'm meant to be doing, you know what I mean, I, it's not explained to me what I need to do, that, this boss is really annoying, because it, it hasn't explained anything, oh wow, I can actually, I can hear him from all the way back here, I'm not gonna lie, I'm calling a bit of absolute BS on that, like, okay, I'm gonna peek again, come on, come on, like, that, that is really annoying that I can actually hit it from all the way over here. And sometimes it just doesn't show the lock on. Like, that is really annoying. Like, like I've literally lost all my beans. Like, okay. That, that, that didn't do anything, by the way, unless I did that totally wrong, which I could have done that totally wrong. Okay, are, are, which one are you going to hit me now? Are you going to hit him for me? Come on. Okay, I, also I've got to wait for his, his little uh, star thing to come, except I'm not hitting myself, because that's not good. Okay, come on. Okay, there we go. Do I need to hit the eye? I do, okay. I've got this down now. I've got this down. I understand. Okay, that is annoying, to be honest. Like, how was I meant to know that? Like, I'm a, I'm a bit annoyed that I lost all my beans. I might actually restart. I'm going to restart, guys. One second. Okay, there we go. I know I haven't got much HP, but, you know, beggars can't be choosers. So, there you go. Anyways, we're back now. I know I haven't got much health, but, you know, beggars can't be choosers. Okay, let's try this out again now. Okay, let's just keep attacking that. Okay, this boss is a lot easier now I know that. Like, that is really annoying that I didn't know that. By the way, as you can see, I'm going to show you how many things I've got. 27. Okay, there you go. I saved it a, a decent time. Okay, let's wait for this. Okay, they're alternating now, which is fine. Okay, come on. You guys just keep alternating. Come on. Oh, he's got a car now. Are you going to fill at me? Are you going to fill at me? Oh, wow. No, he's not. He's going to he's gonna kind of like do some funky business with it, aren't you? Okay, go on. You keep doing that. Put it back down. Yes. Okay. We're just waiting for the light spot to show up. Okay. These guys can't seem to get me back here, which is good. Which is good. Okay, come on. Okay, he's got his light up now. Come on. Boom, attack. I'm, I'm attacking. I'm attacking. There we go. Boom. Attack the eye. Boom, there we go. Fall back, fall back. Okay, there's one more hit, one more hit. T to be honest, this boss is very difficult, especially if you don't know what you're doing. Also, I'm not going to risk going for that, because it's right in the middle of the AI. This AI is brutal, and it will literally rinse you. So, okay. Okay, just keep going, just keep going. Just dodge that, dodge that, back and forth, back and forth. Okay, I feel like this pan's pretty easy to, easy to do when you know what's actually expected, so... Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. Um. Okay, let's try this again. Oh god, dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay, okay, it's fine. Are you going to throw it again? Nah, he's going to keep hitting. Okay, okay. I'm not going to lie. That that boulder did throw me off quite a bit. I'm, I'm not going to deny that. That boulder did throw me off. Okay, what are you going to do? Oh, okay, I'm moving back and forth. Okay, let's get him. Come on. Hit, hit, hit him. Come on. Boom, there we go. Get him. There we go. Ah! Oh. Thanks, Harry. Much appreciated. Oh, it was nothing. Anyway, we'd better get a move on. 
We don't want Professor Snape catching us out so late. Why don't you try that door, Harry? I'm not gonna lie, that boss though was annoying as hell. I really did not like that boss. It was a bit too BS if you ask me. W really BS. The only thing I'm not looking forward to this time is seeing Snape. Let's just hope he's left because he missed out on the defense against the Dark Arts job again. Or he might have been sacked. I mean, everyone hates him. Or maybe he's waiting to hear why you two didn't arrive on the Hogwarts Express. Professor Snape, we, uh, we were... In my search of the grounds, I noticed that considerable damage seems to have been done to a very valuable Whomping Willow. I will be speaking with Professor McGonagall later. That tree did more damage to us than we... Silence! I would advise you both to make your way immediately to the Gryffindor common room. But Professor Snape, we... Go, and count yourselves lucky. If I should catch either of you out after tonight, I will definitely deduct house points. Come on, Harry. I'll meet you outside the entrance hall. Okay, and with that, we have arrived at Hogwarts. But, I do think it's about time we actually end off the episode here. So, enjoy this video. Please give a like, I'm really appreciate it. I still stand by that boss was utter BS, but... Next time, we're actually going to go and speak to Ron and actually get into Hogwarts and uh, start the Hogwarts side of the game. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Peace.